Hey everyone, today we're diving into a frustrating issue that's been plaguing a lot of Oblivion Remastered players, the dreaded fatal error that pops up when you try to exit the game, or worse, crashes you in the middle of gameplay or at startup. Basically, what's happening is that Windows or the game engine itself is blocking certain files that need to run or shut down properly. On Windows 10 and 11, there's a security feature called Controlled Folder Access that sometimes flags the Oblivion executable as unsafe preventing it from writing or removing temporary files during shutdown. On the other hand, the Unreal Engine 5 setup used by Oblivion Remastered relies on certain NVIDIA DLSS libraries to compile shaders and render scenes, and if one of those libraries is corrupted or incompatible, the game can't decompress its shader cache and just crashes out. First up, let's talk about the Windows security angle. If your game is dying on you every time you close it, it might be because Windows thinks it's tampering with protected folders. What you need to do is open Windows Security, head to Virus and Threat Protection, then Manage Ransomware Protection. From there you'll see Controlled Folder Access, and you'll want to allow an app through that feature. Click to add an allowed app, pick the recently blocked apps list, and you should spot Oblivion Remastered Win64 Shipping.exe in there. Add that, and suddenly the game can shut down without triggering a fatal error. It's like giving the game permission to tidy up after itself. Next, let's look at the NVIDIA DLSS culprit. Many players discovered that the file named slpcl.dll in the game's plugin folder, specifically under engine backslash plugins backslash marketplace backslash NVIDIA backslash DLSS backslash streamline backslash binaries backslash third party backslash Win64, was causing crashes during shader compilation or when loading into the world. Deleting or renaming that file makes the game bypass the faulty DLSS streamlining process, and voila, it launches and runs without unceremoniously dumping you back to the desktop. If you're still getting startup crashes or shader compile errors, updating your graphics driver could be the key. NVIDIA sometimes releases hotfix drivers outside the normal game-ready updates. For example, the 576.15 hotfix driver fixed shader compilation crashes not just on the newest cards but on older RTX cards too. Just grab it from NVIDIA's official site, install, reboot, and you may find the game runs smoothly. Finally, if you find yourself mid-game and every loading screen becomes a crash fest, dialing back your graphics settings and capping the frame rate can help ease the strain. Set a reasonable FPS cap, say 60 or 120, switch DLSS to performance mode, and drop ultra settings down to high or medium. This reduces CPU and GPU overhead enough that the game stops tipping over under its own weight. Give these fixes a try, and hopefully you'll get back to exploring Tamriel without those fatal interruptions.